guys, it's Kath, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we are gonna be doing an Amazon shopping haul. I'm so excited about this, because I love sharing deals with you guys. I share it on Instagram all the time, usually in my stories, on my personal page, and our home page. So today's video, I'm gonna be sharing all the home essentials that I bought on Amazon. And it's a lot of stuff, and I'm gonna try to break it down into categories. I'm gonna give you guys the prices for what I paid, but quick disclaimer, Amazon prices are usually changing very often, so I'm gonna show the price I got, but you probably will find it at a different price, who knows? So we're gonna get right into it. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and join the family, and make sure you hit that little bell button so you're notified whenever I post a new video and you're not left behind. Give it a thumbs up, all that good stuff, share it with a friend, and make sure you follow me on Instagram because that is where I share everything as soon as I buy it. So, if you want the inside scoop of all the things that your girl is buying, follow on Instagram. <laughs> all right, let's get right into this. So the first category is gonna be things that I bought for my kitchen, and this one is one of my absolute favorites. This utensil holder with this like little bamboo type of color going on here. I really love the wood tones. It actually came with the utensils and this, all for $20. So love the vase, love the utensils, really, really great price, and it just matches the aesthetic that we're going for in our kitchen. To go along with that, I also got this bamboo paper towel holder. It has this nice little silver detailing at the top. It was the nicest one I can find. I really love it. I mean, it's simple, and I just really wanted a bamboo paper towel holder, and this was $13, and like I said, it matches the whole vibe. Next is this glass soap dispenser bottle with a matte black top. I really wanted something to, like I said, go with the kitchen. This actually came with a two pack, so we have one in the bathroom upstairs, and then we have one downstairs, and this holds our hand soap while the other dispenser that like is built into the sink holds the dish soap, so I love it. It's so much cuter than, you know, like your soap um, bottle that it comes with. And the next one is probably one of my favorite purchases for the kitchen, because it's just so aesthetically pleasing, and it just like, it's just, so exciting that I even have a place for this because my kitchen in our last apartment before we actually bought our first home, this home that we're in, was so small guys. Like I literally only had one drawer and that was for utensils and I had two other full size cabinets. Like that was it. I had no space. but. God is so faithful. He multiplies, he provides abundantly beyond. God is good. So, because I have so many more drawers, by the grace of God, I wanted to make sure that I had my spices right near my stove. So, I got these 14, this 14 pack spice jar set. It was $25 for the 14 pack. It actually came with two different types of labels to put on it as well. And they're just so cute. You literally put all your spices in here. And then I also purchased this adjustable, expandable spice rack. It has like three tiers here and you put it right in your drawer like this. And then these spices sit like that, right in your drawer. How cute is that, right? It's pretty cool because um, if you have a skinnier drawer, you can kind of just use it as this. But if you have a wider drawer, you can just expand it so it's as big as you need it to be. This was only six $15, which I think is such a great price because you're getting that organization that you want So I know it's just a drawer to some people, but we are really really limited in our last apartment So I'm just super grateful to have the space and to be able to get things like this Like I said, it came with two different types of labels But I didn't love the font and I really wanted something more cursive like calligraphy So I actually bought a pack that comes with 200 different labels and it comes with um, the calligraphy and it comes in black and in white so that has like the vibe that I'm looking for, but it's really not necessary. This pack of 200 was under $10. So kind of gives me the look that I'm going for at a really good price. So I'll link that down below. Next up is this sponge holder. I wanted it matte black because our kitchen sink is black and just so chic. So I really wanted something that kind of just blends in right there. This was $14, no, $11. Really good price, I believe it's from M Design, which a lot of these um, like organizational items are from. So I got it from Amazon, but the M Design store. The next one, which is also from M Design, which is another one of my favorites, and you guys seem to love it on Instagram when I shared it too, is this tea bag holder. How cute is this? Oh my gosh, like when people come over, I'm gonna like, would you like some tea? What would you like? Which one would you like? Would you like some bedtime tea? Would you like some energy tea? Oh, here you go, honey. <laughs> Nobody ever drinks tea when they come over, but I mean, now I can offer it in a cute way. 
Um, it's just really awesome that it's functional. I got rid of so many boxes because I had all these teas, but they were all in boxes and they took up so much space. So this just sits right in my pantry. It's super slim and literally holds everything that I need right in there. Okay, and the last product for kitchen supplies is something that I bought because we just needed, but I didn't think that I was actually gonna really love it as much as I do. Just some placemats, some really cute gray placemats. Um, they were pretty affordable. I wanna say they were, looking at my list here, $14 for a six pack. And it's kind of like this woven material, so it's really easy to clean. I just kind of like wipe it with the sponge and the water kind of goes through it, you know? So um, I love that. And it just looks really, really nice on our quartz so like white countertops. So now we're gonna go into the next category, which is lighting. We have bought a lot of lights for this house and I found myself like always sharing it you guys always asking about certain links and stuff so I figured one video share it all right so the first one is the chandelier light that is in our staircase obviously I don't have it here to show you but I will insert a clip <laughs> to show you guys I absolutely love this chandelier light so much it was only $64 guys could you believe that like I feel like these lights you'll usually see for like $300, $400. I've seen some in certain stores for that price. And the fact that this was $64 and I figured, you know what, it's Amazon. If we don't love it, if it looks cheap or whatever, we'll just return it. No, it looks absolutely beautiful. We haven't figured out exactly what light bulbs we want to put in it. That's why there's a few missing. But I mean, it serves its purpose. It really is like the statement piece of our staircase and it just makes it look like I don't know, brings the whole like staircase area of our home together rather than it just being a staircase. So love it so much and it was so affordable. It's matte black. I mean, I just, I love everything about it. It did not come with a light bulb, so keep that in mind. We have to purchase ours, which is why it's missing some. <laughs> the next one is our outdoor porch lights. I love these so much because it was another one of those things that we bought and we were like, okay, let's see how it looks and we loved it. It wasn't too big, it wasn't too small. It really gives us that modern farmhouse feel, which is what we wanted our home to be. Ties into the cedar accents of our exterior. I love it so much, and it was only $29. And I think that's a really great price, because like I said, lighting can be super expensive. So this was one of those Amazon purchases that I was so happy with. We got one for the front and one for the back. I do want to say that last time I checked, they were out of stock, but I'm going to link them down below anyways, just in case they come back in stock. And if not, I will link an alternative that kind of looks similar, um, just for your reference. And hopefully, you know, it'll be a good find. But remember with Amazon, if you purchase something that says free returns, go return it. If it don't work for you, return it. <laughs> Next, we have these wall sconces for our bathroom. We actually haven't put it up yet, but I just want to show you guys what it looks like. This is going to be for our master Beth. Beth? Who's Beth? Our master, master Beth. <laughs> My master Beth. <laughs> so annoying. This is actually gonna be for our master bathroom upstairs. It's going to go right above, we think it's gonna go right above the two mirrors, which is also an Amazon purchase that we'll get to. But I really, really love this because it was under $30. I think we paid 25, 26 bucks for it. And it's really great because it's matte black and it has like the little gold accents that pulls the entire bathroom together. Super cute and like I said, I think I love it the most because it's lighting for like $25. That's just, it's just so rare to find deals like that. Next we have the flush mount lights that we pretty much have in every bedroom and in the living room and a couple other places in our home. I really love like the detailing in this, how it has like two black rims around it. We really wanted something again with the matte black accents. Um, and this was just another really affordable option. This one was $26 and because we needed a lot of lights around the house, we wanted to make sure we got something that was really affordable. I love that this one is 4,000K, which is like a daylight glow. We didn't want anything yellow, which I think 3,000K is yellow. 5,000K can sometimes be too bright white where it's like blue tone. So we feel like the 4,000K in these were a pretty good um, choice for us because we really want the bright and airy vibe. So that one was awesome, we love that. The other lights that we got are the motion sensor ceiling lights and that we have in the boys' um, bedroom closet and the pantry closet and a couple, of, a couple other places. But I love that it's motion sensor because it's like just 30 seconds, it kind of stays on if it senses you there. So when we're in the pantry, like in and out, and then after 30 seconds, it turns off, which 
that's really great. And same thing for the boys closet and then the closet in the hallway as well. This was a great option for us for those rooms and areas that didn't have switches because we felt like it would just be more expensive for us to pay an electrician to add switches to areas that we just needed lights really quickly. So you know what, pay $20 for each light instead of also paying to install light switches in other areas. So I think it was a great option for us to keep our costs down. And then the last item for lighting I actually have right here. This is I think a 12 inch flush mount light and this is going to go into our breakfast nook. We have one right now and I'll insert a clip but as you can see it's very yellow. I accidentally bought 3000K and this one is actually adjustable. You can either choose 3000, 4000 or 5000 so we get to kind of play around and see what light looks best there and then the one that we have there right now is nine inches so it just looks too small in the area. It's not a big deal. I wasn't going to let it bother me but I was like you know what I'll just return it while I still can because it's Amazon and we'll switch it out for this bigger one and it has the lighting that we like the 4000k which is more like of a full tone or just like that natural daylight glow so i love it because it's just like simple matte black you know what i mean that stays flush up against the ceiling and it's just that nice look that we're going for now i do have to say we're not going to ask our electrician to come back and do that so we're gonna hope and let's let us pray that sean can watch a youtube video figure out how to do it himself and not get electrocuted in the name of jesus and now we just have a bunch of other things that kind of don't go into a category. The first one that I'm going to say is our Bluetooth speaker slash vent in our master bathroom. Oh my gosh, this is one of my favorite purchases because, girl, it is a loud speaker that you have right in your bathroom. So whenever I get into the shower, I literally just press that little switch, play my worship music, my sermons, my podcast whatever it is and i am having a good time it's like a concert i sound so good when i'm singing in the shower with that speaker on <laughs> so i think that this was one of my favorite purchases we actually only bought one for the upstairs bathroom because we didn't think we'd need it for downstairs but i really wish we did because when i'm soaking in the bath I want music playing. So now we kind of have to plug in the Alexa or plug in a speaker, you know? So I think eventually we really will switch that out. But the price was only $92. And I think for as much as we use it, as much as we love it, it's a really great price for what you're getting. Next are these matte black doorknobs. I really, really love the matte black look, as you know. I feel like we could have just gone with, you know, regular silver or gold doorknobs. But this is just really the vibe that we're going for in our home. And I really feel like it adds such a beautiful touch on the doors they were $13 each because they're the privacy knobs so um, they're not an actual lock that needs a key but you know like the regular privacy where you can use a quarter or whatever to get in if you have to I know that they also had options that were just like plain doorknobs they didn't have the privacy lock on it and those were much more affordable as well so there's different options and to go along with that obviously we needed well didn't need but I wanted black hinges for each door as well so this was an 18 pack it also came with six door stoppers which was great too I thought that was a nice plus and this one was $31 for 18 of them so it's pretty much going to take care of all the doors that we need upstairs and I mean you can just see how beautiful that looks it really does make such a huge difference next one is the mirror for our bathroom I was looking for, I was kind of torn between a round mirror or a rectangular one. And I asked you guys on Instagram, a lot of you guys voted for this, so I was really happy with it. We paid $72 and we bought two of these for the master bathroom upstairs. And I honestly love the way it looks. I was a little worried when I saw the pictures because it had this like beveled edge. Um, but you really can't even tell when you're looking at the mirror. I think as of right now, it's out of stock, but that may change. So I'm going to link the one that I bought down below, but also going to find a similar one and link that as well. And the size that we got was 22 by 30 for those who wanted it. Then we have our TV wall mount. I paid $50 for this. It was a really great mount. Sean said it was pretty easy. Eh, actually... From what I remember, it didn't look that easy. It kind of took him a while, but he said it was pretty easy and he trusts it. He says he will he would hang from it, but I was like, absolutely not. <laughs> but um, for the most part, it was a $50 mount. It held up our 58 inch um, TV. And yeah, that was just another one of the purchases. Nothing really to say there. Oh, I do have to say, I like the way it turns from side to side and like tilts up and down as well. And it extends off the wall. We wanted one that had like a lot of versatility in that sense. So, and next we have this hair catcher. I really wanted a hair catcher because this is our own house and I am not trying to get clogged the uh, bathtubs and all the things and sinks and all. No, like I, I'm not trying to call a plumber. I don't know. Just no. So we're going to take as many precautions as we can. 
So I bought this hair catcher. It actually came in a five pack for $10, which is a really great price. And it came in a bunch of different colors, like a blush pink one, my mom took one. But I have one in the bathroom upstairs. And then I also have one at the sink as well. I think this one's in the sink. So that way any food, we already have like a food catcher thing, um, drain stopper um, in our sink, but I just wanted extra precaution, like I said, because I don't want to call a plumber back here. Plumbers are expensive. <laughs> so um, I, I like this because the fluid kind of gets caught in it as well. It does a really good job as catching at catching my hair too. And um, it works really great because our drain in our shower is flat. So this one just like sits right up top and the hair just kind of gets tangled up in there. So those. Okay, next is this privacy film that we actually got for our doors, our front door and our back door because they have a little bit of glass at the top and <laughs> we just realized that it's just not comfortable to know that anyone could just kind of be like <laughs> peeking through the glass. So um, we bought this off of Amazon. It was $10 for a full roll and we're honestly not going to use all of this. Um, and it's so easy to apply. You literally just cut it off the, the sizes that you need and like use water I think and then just apply it on to the window. We're also going to put it on to our bathroom window upstairs um, just because well, most likely when we get shades, we want to keep the shades up to keep the natural light coming in, but still want that privacy so no one can see us showering outside. <laughs> I think we are on our last item, this drill attachment set, which as soon as I started, I was like, okay, I definitely need that. So it's pretty much a set of a bunch, let me show you, a bunch of drill attachments that you use. You literally attach this right onto your drill and then use it to get like a really great deep clean without all the elbow grease. It's gonna save you time and energy and I'm all about that. So it's a 22 piece set for $23, so like around a dollar a piece, right? And you have all these different attachments here that are great for scrubbing different surfaces. So you literally pop this onto the drill, turn the drill on, and this is really gonna be great to clean your grout, your tile, kitchen, some people say sink, like really any area that you need a deep clean, you have all these different attachments. So I have absolutely loved this one. Like I said, 23 bucks, I feel like you really can't beat that. So I think that that's pretty much it. It was a lot of products that we had here, but you know what, I really, I really am just so happy about all of them. And I wanted to share everything in one place for you guys. So if you like videos like this where I kind of do shopping hauls and for more home stuff, because I think this is the first shopping haul I've done for home stuff, which is kind of crazy. I haven't gone shopping or bought clothes in a while because quarantine, I wasn't going anywhere. So this is what I've been doing, buying stuff from my house, my first home. I just, God, it's so good. So yeah, if you guys want more videos like this, let me know down below in the comments and let me know if you buy any of this stuff too. I'm gonna have all the links down below in the description box. So make sure you check that out um, and let me know in the comments if you guys end up getting anything. And let me know if there are any other stores that you want me to share, you know, shopping hauls for. So I love you guys so much. I hope this video was helpful. I hope you guys are staying safe out there, staying clean, washing your hands, staying prayed up. I love you so, so much and I'll see you in the next video. Be blessed.